uh, Future Chen Foundation is uh, very interesting in, in two aspects. Uh, the first one is the selection of the problem. Um, it doesn't chase uh, uh, headlines, so to speak. And uh, uh, what it tries to do is, that's uh, interesting, is it, uh, it polls the community of uh, the foundation to come up with uh, what should be the future. And during our conversations, during the conferences, uh, we're able to work backwards from that future as to what are the obstacles and the opportunities. Uh, I find that very, very interesting because uh, in many ways we can start to think outside of the box. And uh, in that sense, uh, not only think out of the box, but we learn different kinds of perspectives from different people on the same issue. And uh, in that sense, I come away from the meeting uh, knowing what is the way forward, so to speak. Okay. Uh, the second thing that I, I find very interesting about uh, the Future Trend Foundation uh, is the people. Uh, it's very rare for us from uh, one sector to interact with people from another, another sector. So in the uh, forum meetings, we have people from academia, uh, we have people from government, uh, we have people from uh, the business world. And uh, for us to interact uh, uh, is a very, very interesting dynamics. Uh, on the business side, we want to make profits, <laughs> but uh, we're not thinking, huh? about uh, whether this is uh, good or bad, uh, or we're not thinking about the policy side. Uh, policy people just want to make rules, and uh, not thinking that whether these rules really meet the needs of the citizens, uh, or that they make the uh, marketplaces a little bit freer. Uh, from a bis uh, from a, a academic point of view, we tend to be too theoretical, and our theories don't often match what's happening in reality. And so being able to act with the uh, business community and policymakers, we confront those realities. What are the politics? Uh, what are the, the market trends that we need to, to think about you know, to expand our theories so that we have a better vision of what the future is going to be? So this idea of uh, these two points, one of power, uh, not power but uh, the problem, and the second about the people that participate, uh, to me are very, very different from many, many meetings that I attend. Um, I think it's the projects. Uh, uh, it's, it's not project singular, but project plural. Uh, in the sense that, uh, as I had mentioned earlier, um, uh, the first project is to draw upon the community of FTIF and find out what the future should be is one major project. So it's getting us to think uh, uh, not about current situations, but how to solve the current situation based on what the future goal is going to be. Uh, this is very Japanese-y, okay, <laughs> that once you have the goal, then you can set the metrics and then the methodology. Okay. So that part of the project is very, very, uh, very good. Uh, and I like to, I can do this in my office and still to engage the community to see where their priorities are. Um, uh, projects in the plural. The second is the actual forum meetings and the exchange of ideas that I had elaborated upon a bit earlier. But uh, the third is that, uh, which another maybe a, a good point about FTF, is the follow-up. That oftentimes we get into these talk shops and then we go home and nobody does anything. But in the case of FTF, we have our publications uh, online as well as offline. And uh, now I've uh, been drawn into this idea of academia, where you are really now going long term, trying to train the future leaders by giving them opportunities to not only work in innovative companies, but companies all over the world. So I'm now in the process of trying to locate some Japanese companies or firms in Asia that will give this opportunity to uh, European students in particular. And so this bridging experience is something that you just can't take away from these younger generation of, uh, of innovators and future leaders. And so I hope it becomes one of the milestones in their life and that they will be able to achieve the long-term goals of the uh, future trend forum.